former Orlando Pirate player Mieni has resurrected his career in Botswana. Guys, uh, Saleng seems to look, the strategy of loaning out players at, at, at um, Orlando Pirate seems to be working very well. I'm going to talk about that. Kama Billiard has got something to say. Man, look, it's not now school be losing Oman Obam Niti, and you know what I'm saying. So I'm going to be talking about that as well. Um, there's a player, there's a defender at Mamelo de San Alonso Pirate that could be joining a new club anytime soon from now. So I don't know where you want me to start because we have a lot to talk about today. But uh, before we do that, good people. I'm asking just one favor, please. And that favor is, if you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. Former Orlando Pirate player, Mieni, has resurfaced and resurrected his career in Botswana. Right. Um, so, you know, it's so, it's so funny. Swissa Mieni has made a huge difference since arriving in, since arriving in the, in the team, Mafu tells ikikoff.com. He's a top professional and our youngsters are learning a lot from him. He scored one of the great goals on Sunday. Look, on Sunday, he still has the hunger to play football and succeed. I hope he will continue doing well for the team. But the fact is, he is in Botswana and he is doing exceptionally well. Reporters imaged suggesting that uh, Manoba Mniti is a wanted man at Royal AM. Now, um, Amazulu as well, it is believed that prior to the, the rescheduling of Sundowns where they demoted Manoba Mniti, they had first made an inquiry about Mangoba, availability of Mangoba Mnuiti from Sandhouse, but unfortunately he was committed at the time and he was still a head coach as well. So right now, Royal AM seems to be interested, but they are monitoring certain situations to see if they can get him or not right. So it remains to be seen if that could succeed. Knowing Royal AM again now, but they've got a lot of things to say. Um... Right, Ichapa United, they are very much interested to sign an Orlando Pirate defender that has fallen out of flavor, at, or favor of flavor, whatever you want to see it, or however you want to see it, at Orlando Pirate, right? They are monitoring the situation. And of course, this Chupa United is interested in signing them Teta from Orlando Pirate. He is the player that has been identified as a potential addition to the team. He did well when he played for the team previously while on loan from Orlando Pirate, and the club would love to have him back. But Chipa is not the only club interested in the player. Golden Arrows is also interested and could also make a move for him in January. Yeah, one other guys. We need to, if you are a Carlos Chips fan, we need you need to be concerned about that because wow, uh, that could actually mean that Pule Modi could be joining Orlando, Orlando Pirate and then Orlando Pirate could give them this defender, right? Um, Orlando Pirate loaned out um, um, launch, he came back a better player after that. Orlando Pirate loaned out Munapule Salen. He came back. He came back a better player. So it has been credited to Orlando Pirates that their loaning strategy seems to be working for them. It has worked wonders that they have loaned players, and those players uh, came back better players. Talking to the, okay, let's let's move to the issue of Kama Billiard, where he was now asked about Kama Billiard, How did you felt when you guys lost a league on the last days? Kama Billiard gave his true reflection and true thought about it in his statement. He's got this to say, lest you accuse me of manufacturing facts. Come up, Billard says again, it's a very, it's a very painful thing. I didn't want to talk about it because it's also hit my heart. Billard told the Vodacom ring a nut as quoted, right? But look, it's professional game. You need to know things. It happens to the best and it happens to everyone. It is one of those things that I was not, the code was not meant to be. We need to understand that we don't fight. We don't fight God for not giving us. 
us we look he has a look he has got a better plan for us we trust his ways but job uh, especially after we were leading there there's a feeling that whereby we already see ourselves celebrating who show who come a billiard but we are old today it was just a painful thing we just need to break ice and get the one cup it's not easy playing without cups because it's also motivates you to have a cup how we and how we how the feeling is it's just another extra motivation says who come a billion right i don't know what you talk about what you think about what come up with others just say but I'll, I'll say to you yeah um it might have damaged ikata jeep's team for not winning the league i just understand that having said that yeah guys me and you will see each other in the next episode but until the next episode please take care